Hey y'all, uh, long time no see. What's up? This is Rock Lee, and today I'm Pastor with Kings. We're chilling in Jamaica, Montego Bay again, and I just want to show y'all some of the things that you can do while you're here. And make sure you guys like and subscribe, and let's check this whole place out. This is Passport Kings. Welcome aboard abroad. If you're only staying at the resort when you take your trips to Jamaica, you may be doing things wrong. I understand getting pampered while on vacation without needing to lift more than a finger to get food, entertainment, and attention from staff. But after a few trips here, you may want to experience Jamaica authentically. Next time you have some free time to get a quick trip to Jamaica, get an Airbnb instead of a resort. Use a cab or personal driver instead of shuttles, and be sure to try out local cuisine instead of always eating at tourist-filled food spots. An experience like driving or getting a lift around the highways and roads from Ocho Rios to Montego Bay to Negril could be the twist on a Jamaica vacation that you didn't realize you needed. Exploring Jamaica by car. Driving through Jamaica offers a unique way to experience the island's natural beauty, vibrant culture, and iconic landmarks. The route connecting Negril, Montego Bay, and Ocho Rios is packed with breathtaking sights, thrilling adventures, and opportunities to immerse yourself in authentic Jamaican life. However, navigating the island's roads comes with its challenges. The two cars come straight towards each other. What y'all call it? Y'all call it chicken? Oh, collision. <laughs> <laughs> Here's a guide to making the most of your Jamaican road trip, including must-see attractions, safety tips, and insights into accommodations. Starting in Negril, relaxation and stunning beaches. Negril, located on Jamaica's western coast, is famous for its relaxed vibe and pristine beaches. The Seven Mile Beach is a must visit with soft white sands and crystal clear waters perfect for swimming and sunbathing. They're working on it now, man. Yeah. Yeah. They're working on it. Oh, that used to be working. Because this is a big sign. Yeah, see there. See, yeah. that's why you're seeing many people not coming there. Oh, okay. Because yeah. Margarita closed. Uh -huh. And they heard about it, say, that big storm where they uh, mash up the whole place. Mm. For a dramatic end to the day, visit Rick's Cafe, perched on a cliff, to witness one of the most stunning sunsets in the Caribbean. If you're feeling adventurous, try cliff jumping into the turquoise sea. <laughs> the roads around Negril are generally manageable, but stay alert for pedestrians and cyclists, especially near the beach area. Montego Bay, the heart of adventure. Heading east, Montego Bay is a bustling city offering a mix of modern conveniences and cultural experiences. Stop at the hip strip for shopping, dining, and entertainment. For nature lovers, the Montego Bay Marine Park provides excellent snorkeling and diving opportunities. It's also the starting point for some of Jamaica's most exciting activities, including chukka adventures. Little bit. The Chukka zip lining experience takes you through lush tropical canopy, providing a bird's eye video. view of Jamaica's verdant landscape. Look who I'm with. We're walking through the jungle. Uh oh. I'm going down, down, baby. Yo, street and pants, river. <laughs> 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 
We're going up, y'all. We are going to the zip line. Make sure all your affairs are in order before you go do this, yeah. But I don't think I can ride with it. That's what I, what I wanted to do, but I want to have both gloves on. No, 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 no. All right, there's you go. Am I even looking at it? I almost missed it. Mm. Yeah, that don't sound like your names, man. The show was awesome. You guys love it. For a more laid-back activity, the Martha Bray River Rafting Experience offers a peaceful ride on a bamboo raft, guided by knowledgeable locals who share stories and folklore. The sea that falls on the tree, the sea got the shape like a heart. Oh really? So most of the time when the wind blowing, you see the tree making up in the air. Oh. I love this tree. What is it called? African tulip. African. Otherwise, otherwise you can say flame, flame of the forest. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And not only that, look, the flower forest it contains some little pads like this. It contains water in some of it. Before you get the flowers, the flowers came from some small pod like this. Mm -hmm. So the all of the pods it just burst open and then the flowers come from the inner pod. Mm. So first time people in Jamaica now, before technology, a lot of people got like a thing they had they call like the camera. Mm -hmm. What they used to do, they used to pick one of the small pods. Like average age. Right. Look at what those people used to eat healthy. They used to do lots of natural stuff. Uh -huh. But most of those people, they gotta be a big major surgery for them to go to the doctor. Headache. Uh -huh. They don't get them to get out of the house. They don't get a teaspoon of castor oil. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Castor oil for cleansing. Castor oil. Right. Yeah. 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 So a lot of people use the castor oil for hair mm -hmm. and for the skin. Like people got like dry skin, uh -huh. they use the castor oil for the skin. Uh -huh. <laughs> Yeah man, and those people, they used to, they used to, they used to raise their own chicken, their own cow, their own goat, everything. Mm -hmm. They used to plant their own food. Okay. And what they used to fertilize them for their own food, they used to like the peeling skin and throw it at the root of the banana. The for peeling skin yeah. of what? Like the banana skin and the yam oh, skin, oh, okay. they throw it back at the root for fertilizer. Oh wow. Oh. So when they kill like a goat or a cow and they can't eat it out, what they do? They chop it into small pieces and they get like the fermented seed, right. pepper and salt and they kind it. Mm -hmm. they like, like a jump, right. uh -huh. and it and put it in. And like it can stay for two three years. Uh -huh. Then they take like a small pieces, they wash, boil, throw the water away, wash, boil like three times, uh -huh. try to get rid of the water. Even now, even now, people still do it now. Even now, people do it now. We got like people sell like palm oil. Second, we like blend our seasoning. Okay. Instead of cutting up the, gar the garlic, we cut it in the blender and uh -huh. we blend it. Mm -hmm. So cooking the chicken, what we do, we punch a lot of holes right. in the chicken or the right. pork, and then we season it. When you punch it, all you season it, the season it. The final stop on your journey, Ocho Rios, is a treasure trove of natural beauty. The Duns River Falls is a highlight where you can climb cascading waterfalls surrounded by lush greenery. The Blue Hole, a series of deep blue pools and waterfalls, offers a refreshing escape and opportunities for swimming and cliff diving. Ocho Rios also has an array of family-friendly attractions such as the Mystic Mountain Adventure Park, where you can try the bobsled ride inspired by Jamaica's Winter Olympics team. The roads leading to Ocho Rios can be winding and steep in places. Drive cautiously, especially in areas with heavy rain, making the roads slippery. Driving in Jamaica can be an adventure in itself. The roads are often narrow and winding, with potholes and uneven surfaces in some areas. Additionally, local drivers can be aggressive, and there's a fair share of pedestrians, animals, and vendors to watch out for. By all means, get yourself a driver for this adventure. You will find very reasonable rates. I'll attach a link to the driver I recommend here. 
While Jamaica boasts world-class resorts with all-inclusive packages, staying in an Airbnb can offer a more authentic and cost-effective experience. Here's why. Cultural immersion. Airbnb hosts often provide insights into local life, food, and hidden gems. Flexibility. You can choose from various options, from budget apartments to luxurious villas, catering to different group sizes and preferences. Privacy and space. Unlike resorts, many Airbnb offers private kitchens, living spaces, and personal touches that make your stay feel like home. However, if you prioritize convenience and on-site amenities such as private beaches, pools, and guided tours, resorts might be the better option. Head to PassportKings.com to book your resort or use my link to book your Airbnb. I'm attaching the link a road trip through Negril, Montego Bay, and Ocho Rios is a fantastic way to uncover the best of Jamaica. From serene beaches and thrilling adventures to vibrant local culture, the journey is packed with unforgettable experiences. By balancing caution on the roads with an adventurous spirit, you'll be able to enjoy everything this beautiful island has to offer. Whether you choose the comforts of a resort or the charm of an Airbnb, Jamaica promises to leave you with memories that last a lifetime. I'm starting to lose track of the number of times I've chosen Jamaica to be my destination of choice for a short vacation. Every time I go, I enjoy myself a little bit more, in new ways. Stepping away from the tourist hotspots, you'll find hidden gems waiting to be discovered in the pristine beaches you've grown used to. Here are the four places I recommend. Blue Mountains. Start by exploring the Blue Mountains where you can hike through lush rainforests, visit coffee plantations, and mingle with locals in quaint mountain villages. Treasure Beach. Head to the south coast and discover the secluded beaches of Treasure Beach, where you can relax in peace away from the crowds, or take a trip to the serene Black River and go on a boat tour to spot crocodiles and exotic bird species. To taste authentic Jamaican culture, visit the maroon village of Akampong, founded by escaped slaves in the 18th century. Here, you can learn about the history of the Maroons, sample traditional cuisine, and immerse yourself in the vibrant music and dance of the local community. Whether you're an adventure seeker, a nature lover, or a cultural enthusiast, Jamaica has something to offer everyone off the beaten path. Get ready to uncover the hidden treasures of this Caribbean paradise like a king.